so today I'm going to be doing another haul for you guys and I know I just did a kind of summer slash fall haul and I'm doing another one and I feel like, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like this time of year I shop the most out of any other time of the year. There's something about like changing seasons like big seasons like summer to fall or winter to spring that I shop like crazy because I think in the back of your mind you know that the weather's going to change and you kind of want to change up your wardrobe and I just go crazy this time of year like I just love shopping for fall clothes even though I don't like fall weather like I don't like cold weather I love shopping for the clothes for cold weather. So I'm going to start off with Target. I only got one thing at Target recently, but I love this thing so much and I couldn't pass it up because you guys know that I have like a jacket fetish. I don't know what my problem is, but I buy so many jackets, it's ridiculous, but I love them. Um, but this one is by Mossimo and it's this really pretty forest green jacket with black sleeves and bronze hardware. And I thought this would be really cute with just like a plain white t-shirt and I thought because it's more of like a, like a soft material, it's not like a blazer material, like that crunchy type of material, it's more like a soft material. So I feel like it's more of like a comfortable jacket rather than a more dressy jacket. So I could just put it on over a white t-shirt, put jeans on and boots and I'd be good to go. So I thought this would be a very comfortable jacket for kind of like everyday wear. So I went to Portland like a few days ago, if you guys watched my vlog channel, and I got to stop at Nordstrom Rack and Forever 21. And I really wanted to get some basic pieces for fall. like. I don't know about you guys, but whenever like the cold weather comes around, I just want to be comfortable. Like that's the biggest thing for me. And I buy so many clothes that I just don't wear that often because they're not comfortable. They're not just like my go-to pieces. So I really wanted to stick to go-to pieces that are comfortable for like everyday wear. So I went to um, Nordstrom Rack and I picked up these really amazing shirts. They were a little bit more on the expensive side, $34 per shirt which is kind of expensive, but I knew that I would get so much wear out of these that I bought them anyways. Um, they're just like these, I don't know what you call them, like bohemian kind of peasanty tops in just plain colors and they have a tie around the neckline which I thought was really cute. I wouldn't tie them though, I would leave them undone. I kind of like that undone look a little bit better. So I would leave it untied and it's just really big, really billowy that I could wear with like skinny jeans and boots or whatever. Um, so I got it in green and then I also got it in black because I knew that I would wear this a lot. You could wear this black one for a fancy occasion or you could wear it for a casual occasion as well. So they're just really comfortable. And then from Target, oh I got this at Target as well, I totally forgot about this. Um, this is the brand Massimo. And this is another shirt kind of similar to the ones I just showed you, that same chiffonny feel. But um, it's just really big and billowy, so I could just put a black tank top on underneath of it and then skinny jeans and boots and I'd be good to go. I love the color and I love that it has the black detailing around like the arms and the neck. I thought that was really pretty. And then I also got to stop at Forever 21. I love Forever 21. I don't care how old I get, I'm always going to love Forever 21. It's just one of my favorite stores. I just love it. So I got um, these really cool slacks. They're like dressy slacks. But at the same time, they're comfortable because they have an elastic waistband. And I know that sounds really weird, but they're really cool. So they have this really nice elastic waistband with these bronze uh, zipper pockets. But they're like slacks. So they have the crease down the leg and then they're kind of tapered. So you could wear like high heels with these. But they're really comfortable because of the elastic waistband. So I thought these were really unique. And I really want to kind of play with them and see what kind of outfit I can put together with those. Maybe I'll do like a lookbook type of thing with those pants, but I thought they'd be kind of fun for like a dressy occasion. Seriously, the hardest part about filming inside or in front of a window is the lighting changes constantly. Like, I need to get box lighting so bad and I have yet to invest in box lighting, but it would make my life so much easier because the lighting keeps changing on me and it's driving me crazy. The next thing I got was also from Forever 21. It's a really simple sweater and like I said, I wanted to keep everything simple and something that I would wear all the time. So I just got this black sweater. It's kind of a high-low hem. And it's really baggy. And then it has these uh, gray sleeves, which I thought were really cute. Just, like I said, really basic and something that I'll get tons of wear out of, which was kind of my goal when shopping lately. So this next shirt is also from Forever 21. And I really like this because I think it's going to be really cute with just like a leather jacket. And it's this really nice, um, it's like a jersey material, so it's really comfortable. It's not like a chiffon. And it's just a chevron type of pattern. And I just really like shirts like this because they're so comfortable. And I could just wear, like I said, like a leather jacket over it. And it would be really comfy. So I picked that up. And then I also picked up these shorts. I thought these would be really nice for fall to just pair like a pair of like opaque black tights under them. Um, and all I have is like regular denim shorts. So I thought getting some colored shorts 
um, or denim shorts in a different color would be nice. So these will be really cute with a pair, like I said, of black tights and my wedge booties. And then maybe like a chunky black sweater or a big scarf or something like that with them. So that's kind of why I got those shorts was more for fall rather than for summer. And then I went to Ross and TJ Maxx, which you guys know I love those stores. Ever since I've been on YouTube, Ross and TJ Maxx have been the two main stores in my hauls because I just love shopping at those stores. Um, so I got this at Ross. And I absolutely love black and white vertical stripes. I think they're so flattering, super cute. Um, I really liked it, and yeah, it kind of reminds me of Beetlejuice, which if you guys have been watching my vlogs, you know I've been obsessed with Beetlejuice. Like, I loved that movie when I was, like, in the 90s when I was a kid, but I'm doing a tutorial based on that movie, so I've been really, like, in that mindset lately of thinking Beetlejuice. So when I saw this, that's the first thing I thought of. So next is this really cute shirt from TJ Maxx. Just a giant, this is going to totally mess up the lighting, but it's a giant, white, humongous t-shirt thing. I don't even know what you would call this. It's like bat wings, really big neck, and I thought this would be so comfortable because it's like the softest material ever, and I just love shirts like this, like the ones that you can just bundle up and get all cozy in and you don't have to worry about looking perfect in them. They're just giant, big, like, blanket shirts. So that's what this is, and I thought it'd be cute with just like a giant scarf and, of course, skinny jeans, my favorite thing ever. Next from Ross, I picked up this really cute pair of leggings, and I thought these were adorable, and I just noticed a giant snag. So these are from Ross, these were $12.99, and they're just leggings, but they have the faux leather stripe down the side, which I thought is really cute. These are just nice because they're kind of like a good alternative to leggings, but at the same time, they still are leggings. They just look a little bit more special because they have the leather down the side. I picked up this. I don't know why I picked this up, to be honest. It was one of those random purchases. I'm not really a graphic tee type of person very often, unless I find a really good one, but for some reason, this one just caught my eye, so I bought it. It has a heart on it, and it says Sestout. Sestout? If anybody speaks French, please tell me what that means. When I tried this on, actually, in my mind, I was like, I wonder what this says. Like, like, what if this says something that totally doesn't relate to me? But, oh well, I think it's really cute. I like the heart, and it has, like, a clear chiffon um, piece around the bottom. And I thought this would be really cute with, like, a leather jacket. And then I picked up... This little cardigan, which I thought would be cute with um, more of a dressy piece, but it's basically just like an open cardigan in the front, and it kind of like opens with like the collar that kind of hangs down in the front. But it kind of looks like it has faux leather on it, which I thought was really cool. It's actually not faux leather, it's like a spandexy material, but it looks like faux leather. So I really thought that was cute. I thought that could be dressed up really, really easily, and also dressed down if you want to dress it down. And then the last thing I picked up was from Old Navy. It's this big chunky sweater that is blue and white striped. This kind of reminds me of like an old lady sweater, but at the same time it looks so comfortable and I'm kind of obsessed with blue and white stripes. I just love that combination together. And with a pair of like cognac boots and skinny jeans, I thought this would be really cute with maybe like a mustard yellow scarf. That would be really cute. And then last but not least, if you guys follow me on Twitter, you saw me tweet this because I just picked these up on Hot Look. And you guys know I love Hot Look. It's like a discount store for like designer brands. And these are the brand Carlos Santana. And this is my second pair of Carlos Santana shoes. And I have to say, Carlos Santana has some really, really cute shoes. Like I was really surprised because I freaking love these. And I love the other pair that I have too. So they're these heels. And I am obsessed with ankle straps that go around your ankle. I think they're so flattering and they're very, very in right now. And these have really cute studs on them, which I really like. And um, the metallic heel, which is really cute. And they're just kind of like a sandal. I don't know, I just thought these were really cute. Not that I have a ton of places to wear heels anymore, but when I do, I'm gonna whip these babies out because I just fell in love with them and I needed to have them. So I picked those up and yeah, that is it for my haul. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions about the pieces that I picked up, go ahead and comment below. And also, check out my vlog channel. I know I mention this a lot, but we vlog every day. At least we try to vlog every day. There's a few days where we don't vlog every day. But for the most part, we vlog every single day. And it's really fun. Just kind of a nice morning routine for you guys. And yeah, I think that's it, guys. So I'll talk to you later. Bye. Oh.